So we went yes. out and we asked people, does science and religion, do they contradict each other? Uh, and, and what are the implications of that? And here's the response that we got. No, not necessarily, because um, they say that scientists, a lot of them are really into like the occult and everything, and that science just kind of proves that there is something more. I think science is its own thing. Um, there's a lot of evidence for science. Religion, I think it's very personal, very cultural. I don't think they need to cross at any time. They're just, they're very two different things. In absolute terms, no. At times, yes. At times, no. I think they're not mutually exclusive. Sometimes, yes, but most of the time, no. I think sometimes they contradict each other. I think sometimes they may come to the exact same answer and they don't even realize it because they're so separate. It's all like they're all knock, they're all trying to knock at the same door. You can reconcile them, but I think they need to be, they're separate. Um, it's not like you can't believe in one if you don't believe in the other, but. Interesting. Yeah, it is a bit rather. Yeah. Uh, especially this common idea that they're, they're totally separate things. But let's face it, both science and Christianity deal with the real world. Mm -hmm. And uh, as I've said in another show, that in fact without the, the assumptions of the Bible, like an objectively real universe and an orderly creation, science itself would not be possible. So mm. in fact, science can't justify its own existence. You, science can't prove the universe is orderly because you'd have to assume order in the experiment you use to try to prove it. So you can't ah, prove it. Okay. It has to assume it. And that assumption comes from the Bible. It doesn't come from evolution and doesn't come from science itself. You can't... Ex um, empirically test the, the claim that everything must be tested empirically. 